They, people be talking about me like your fat ass. You want no strip? You damn right. I want no stripping when I was big. I was a skinny bitch, but it was a you, fat bitch who showed me the tricks. Okay, it was a bitch about four hundred pounds. No, named Lollipop. Lollipop. Uh, Lollipop. And when Lollipop. I say this bitch was one flexible motherfucking Big koala Lollipop. bear, yes. this bitch was a f flexible koala bear. This bitch wow. did tricks. She stood on her head. She did splits in the air. And she pounds. would come down light as a motherfucking fat of 400 pounds. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. I always see them put the dollar. You see them put the dollar on the uh -huh. thing and then they blow it with their mouth. I oh, thought yeah. they were blowing it with the cooch, but no, I yeah, but listen, <laughs> I, listen. I want to tell y'all something. The Give coochie, us the tricks. The coochie is a wonderful pocketbook. You okay. know what I'm saying? The coochie, <laughs> that motherfucker is like a rubber band. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? If your pussy ain't like a rubber band, you need something. You know, but a, a coochie Snap back. Hold, you know, a coochie can do a lot of motherfucking things. I don't know. You guys have children together? Yeah, yeah. Okay. But, okay, so have you been in the delivery room? Hell no. Oh, okay, let me tell you. Hell no. So, so, but hold on. I'm scared hold as hell. Me, you I know where you're going with this. I did not have my kids naturally. Yeah. Oh! Okay, let me tell you something. When, when when you have a baby and it's gonna fuck up a lot of people's perception about a pussy. You know what I'm saying? I know a lot of people say the bitch ain't got no walls and all yeah, that's what they say. Check this out. Check this out. For you, let me educate a couple of you, my yeah, men. They say that you know what I'm saying? It stretches out and it don't always go all the way back the way how it used to be. Listen, no, 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 that ain't even it. When a, a female is turned on by a man, okay. she gets wet. Right. And her walls loosen up. Uh, right. Yeah. That's right. so you can enter it, stupid. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. 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 Everybody don't know that. No, no. This motherfucker say, well, she ain't got no walls. No, she was turned on by your ass and shame on her for kissing your ass with her motherfucking <laughs> ass closed too tight. Shame on her. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Because she gave you that good shit because that was good. You know what I'm saying? The bitch was wet and ready. Right. It, that was the good shit. And you sit up there talking about the bitch ain't got no walls. When she was turned on by you, shame that's on the her. Way, that's right. the way some people. You know you right. I they heard that. They're not smart. They don't know about they're it. They're not smart. Well, well, let me ask you this. I want to get back in that strip club. So oh, yeah. You, I was getting ready to tell you this. Yeah, and I just told going. you how the pussy is a wonderful yeah, pocketbook. It, yeah, it's you know a what I'm saying? wonderful so, pocketbook. It was the people, they, people be talking about me like, yo, fat ass, you want no strip. You damn right. I want no stripping when I was big. I was a skinny bitch. But it was you, a fat bitch who showed me the tricks. Okay. Mm. It was a bitch about 400 pounds. No. Named Lollipop. Lollipop. Uh, Lollipop. But when Lollipop. I say this bitch was one flexible motherfucking Big koala Lollipop. bear, yes. this bitch was a flexible koala bear. This bitch wow. did tricks. She stood on her head. She did splits in the air. And she pounds. would come down light as a motherfucking fat of 400 pounds. Understand this. Where did she work at? We. We. we, we every she time still I doing it? I don't know. Hell no, that whole girl, man. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm, this some real she shit. Be a, that when you were younger then. This I was younger. This is 20 years ago. Yeah, she might still be in there. I hope she not. I hope not. Lollipop, if you're out there. I love to have you on Boss Talk Lollipop. If you're out there, I'll let your boy. It's a unique house. This is some real shit. And look, so... um. Like I said, she was one of the people who showed me tricks. Right. Now, I done seen y'all know those big ass suckers. Yeah. This bitch pussy done swallowed one of those suckers and spit that wait. motherfucker back out. I said, oh! Where it go? Wait, wait, it went in. Yeah. It went in. So one of the, my most famous tricks that I did, believe it or not, y'all remember, uh, what the fuck, uh, uh, what the, y'all remember this phone company that had the little bubble head alien on it with the things? Yeah, yeah, okay. yeah. yeah. My, uh, whatever the fuck it was, them, they have funny shaped phones. The funny shaped phones look like a dog bone to me, I guess. Don't tell me you put that. Shape, look, the first trick <laughs> I learned was from old girl. This bitch, me and her had the same exact motherfucking phone. This bitch put that phone in her motherfucking pussy and she pushed it back out and that bitch was ringing. Ooh. And she had the nigga answer the motherfucking phone. That no. was the first motherfucking phone. I said, my yeah. pussy ain't that big, bitch. Yeah. Oh. It's not that big. Yeah, it's she crazy. said, baby, she said, trust me, trust me, trust me, trust me. I said, trust you. I said, bitch, I can't put no phone in my pussy. Oh, she shit. said, bitch, put the phone in your pussy. I put that motherfucking phone in my pussy and I made $1,800. God, no. My ass on the phone, motherfucker. My ass on the phone. When that old ring is. Yes. Who the hell? You got a call yes. from. You know what I'm yes. talking about? You. Get your phone. Hey, my promoter was over there smiling. I'm calling back. I've never I'm seen calling. that before. Don't so you worry. Sorry. You heard about how, it today. How wow. long did you, you going to make me Google that. How long yeah. did you dance for? I danced, um, I danced a couple of years. A couple of years. And so, as you went what through. What made that, you stop? She was. <laughs> She was selling dope in that hole. 
I know. Well, I stop a it's a couple of reasons um, that made me stop, but one of them I'm going to talk about. Um, one of the reasons that I stopped was motherfuckers accused me, me and a chick that I knew of robbing a place. Robbing one of the things And I had to go through A bunch of shit to clear my name When all the time the chick who I was with Um This particular night at this party Um she had She was in a car with a dude she called her guy And I'm pretty sure she had just met the motherfucker yeah. She one of these type of bitches who just Every nigga she see is my man My man my man <laughs> bitch that ain't your man You don't know him you know what I'm saying But how it go guy. these two gentlemen You know what I'm saying these two dickheads They drop us off at this party Now they get out the car and they come in Because it's a lockdown it's a big ass party Or whatever but um, they linger around. I wasn't feeling well. So it was a comedian back in Chicago at that time. His name was Big Daddy Woo Woo. They called him Tornado. He used to um, frequent Jenny Jones a lot. Mm -hmm. This, that, and the third. So I went over and crawled up on, on, on Tornado lap and I said I wasn't feeling good. He said, he said, you ain't feeling good? I said, nah. He said, you want me to take you home? I said, yeah, I had been there. You know, I had been there 15, 20 minutes or whatever. So I leave and I go. The next fucking day, I found out that the party had been robbed. Not only had it been robbed, but it had been shot up. And the chick who party it was, um, her boyfriend had been shot. And the the two dudes who dropped us off had... had the, the two dudes who, that had dropped us off had robbed the fucking place. You know, so I had to... Um, I, I pretty much had to fight up out of a strip club. <laughs> and... and and I went through a lot to clear my fucking name. Let motherfuckers know that wasn't me. So that. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101.